The Ossetians are reputed to be austere folk, but one only has to see this dance known as the Hanga Kaft, or an invitation dance, to know there is a beating heart inside. It is a way for a man to express his love for a woman. It is centuries old and occupies a unique place among all the ethnic Caucasian dances. Never have men in the Caucasus knelt before women. Instead, they tiptoe with great pleasure. So please communicate on your toes all through the dance to make us understand that you have a crush on her. The peculiarity of the Honga calf for the male dancer is that he has to balance on his toes for up to four minutes sometimes to show off his grace and willpower, a skill that it requires considerable effort and is far from comfortable. You just cannot let anybody see that it hurts you. You have to conceal it at all costs. Unlike female ballet dancers who use hard toed plant shoes, for an invitation dance, men wear boots made of thin soft leather resembling stockings. To lessen the pain, dancers pad their toes with cotton wool, but this makes tiptoeing only a tiny bit less painful. Nadar Pliyev has devoted 40 years of his life to the Hanga calf and is long familiar with the ache it gives. I know dancers who even fainted because of the pain, but to hell with the toes, this dance is the soul of our people. A soul in which love and pain come together and find their expression in a passionate dance. Vladimir Dimitrov, Russia Today.